gang and welcome to one of uh, Tone's Kind Thoughts and today as you can see we're going to be doing some uh, baking, some cooking because what we're going to be learning about today is manifesting. You know those deepest desires and dreams that you really can feel inside that you want to see happen around you as a reality. Now I, I read the secret about this many many years ago that really everything we could possibly desire is already within us we'd simply need to become aware of it we need to uh, realize it's already here and when I first heard that I thought you know this is crazy I don't understand this it's too deep it's um, it's too philosophical so today we're gonna ba bake a cake together and uh, we're gonna see that this cake is gonna be our vision our dream and we're actually gonna manifest that but it's the ingredients which make all of the difference. I want to share the knowledge that I've learned over the last 15 years with you. Um, but let's first of all have a look at a quote by Jim Rowan because this is an absolute classic. Uh, come here and I'll show you. So here it is. Here's Jim's uh, quote. It is the set of the sails, not the direction of the wind, that determines which way we will go. Now that is an absolute classic and it's basically telling us that we're all born with the abilities to create our dreams. We simply need to become aware of them and use them. So let's have a look at the ingredients that are going to go into baking my chocolate cake. And that chocolate cake I want you to imagine is that manifestation, that actual creation that we're going to, uh, to uh, bring into fruition. Let's have a look. Okay, and here's the first one, vision. You've got to have a vision inside your mind of what it is that you want to create, but not an exact vision. I mean, these two samples of cakes here are probably not going to look exactly like the cake that's going to be manifested, but vision, that general essence of where it is that you want to be, absolutely crucial. Okay, and uh, here's the next one. Here we have the flour. It's actually got chocolate uh, flavouring in for a chocolate cake, that's which we saw our manifestation. But here we have some flour, um, and this really we're, we're going to be calling passion because you need that. Uh, you've got to go with what it is that you're passionate about. Otherwise, really, it's a waste of time. Um, the universe works on the passion and on emotion, so go with what it is that you're passionate about. Okay, and here's the next ingredient. It's imagination and expectancy, which I've represented here with some eggs. Because, you know, you've got to hold that vision in your imagination and realize that is communicating with the world universe. But even more important, expect. Expect that dream to come true because the universe works in accordance with your expectancy. Okay, the next ingredient, uh, represented here by chocolate and uh, butter, baking butter, is awareness. If you're ever in doubt about how to master manifestation and how you're connected to the universe, how you are a spiritually creative being, then what you need to do is to keep studying. Raise that level of awareness over and over again and you'll get to the point of certainty. And this is the magic ingredient which I represented here with chocolate because I'm actually going to be putting some real chocolate into this chocolate cake and just see how that melts in with the magic flavours of awareness. And the next ingredient is awareness of being connected to everything in the universe. And this bowl here represents, uh, this mixing bowl represents the universe, the area that we're gonna drop this dream into as a, as a flour, eggs, and milk. Because you need to be aware that you're connected to everything out there in the universe. Scientists now have worked out that the universe actually fitted into the size of a pea originally. So every thought you have doesn't just drop into an empty ocean, it connects with an equal vibratory level. Okay, and here's the next one, faith. And this is represented by water and milk, which is going to go into the cake uh, mixture. You know, faith is that realisation that your prayer is going to be answered. You've got to have that faith that you're working now with a higher level of awareness. Okay, let's recap. Here are all of those ingredients again. But finally, I've just put the oven on, ready to mix this cake and put it into the oven. And the last two qualities which are absolutely crucial while you wait for that dream, that vision to come into manifestation, is gratitude and will be in an aware state of receptivity as well. Okay, here goes. I'm uh, going to add in the, uh, the eggs into the mixture, all of those ingredients and some water as well and we're going to mix all of this together and this is really the time when you're uh, you're living with your dream um, being with it in that state of awareness and belief and faith that it's going to come into fruition so i'm going to mix this together now the secret is of course is to uh, mix all of these qualities all of these qualities we've just been learning about 
all together and keep in that state of awareness for as long as you possibly can in a constant state of gratitude. So if you leave me here, I'm going to be busy for the next uh, 20 minutes, I think, mixing this together and we'll see what we end up with. See you in a bit. Okay, so here's the exciting part. We've got all of those ingredients uh, out in front of you here, all of those ingredients for manifestation, but here's the exciting part. You're going to blend all of those levels of awareness together, and we're going to mix this into a lovely chocolate cake mixing tin. I'm really, really excited. Here we go, guys. Really excited. Okay, all that remains now, of course, is to put this lovely uh, mixture into the oven, this mixture of awareness to create that beautiful chocolate cake, which, of course, represents our dream. So here goes, guys. Okay, so the cake is uh, in the oven, and this is the, this is the best bit I always enjoy, which is uh, licking the bowl out, which my mother always used to ask me to do when she was making cakes. Um, I've made a bit of a mess making this cake, but you know what, this is, this is the best bit. So really, you should really be enjoying uh, manifesting your dreams. It's got to be enjoyable because the universe works for you. You are an infinite spiritual being. Okay, and uh, here's the moment of truth. Um, we've manifested our lovely chocolate cake. So let's just... This so I'm going to ice that later on. So remember everybody that uh, if you can bake a cake, you can manifest you spiritual human being. There's a beat in my heart that lays there next to you.